Just in is a super sharp 1968 Ford Mustang, done in a triple black, beautiful raven black paint, black vinyl top, black bucket seat interior. It's riding on a super nice set of Kreger SS rims, uh, 17 inch tires, they're 225, 45, 17. Um, the rims really set the car off. Has all new wheel well trim, rocker molding, all that stuff is brand new. It does have the uh, chrome mirror on the driver's side. It's powered by a powerful V8 engine, four barrel carburetor. Um, does have headers. It's a nice uh, de detail kit on the interior, on the uh, engine compartment. Radiator looks brand new. It's got an Elderbrock carburetor, an Elderbrock uh, Performer RPM intake, MSD ignition, all new plug wires. This car really screams down the road. Got a nice even hood gap from front to back. It's a wider gap, but very even. Fits the fender very nicely. Gap over on the passenger side is nice and even as well. A little tighter in the very in the back, but we still have plenty of gap back there. Um, this front corner probably the stopper needs to be adjusted a little bit on this front corner. Sits down just a little bit. As far as our front bumper goes, the bumper is new. It's in excellent condition. The grill's in great shape. The horse is in nice shape on the grill. Um, it's got a transmission cooler up there in front of the radiator. Now the paint on this car, I would classify it as absolutely beautiful driver quality, local car show quality car. It's been wet, sanded, and buffed to a beautiful shine. Just got a, a very nice body on it, super straight. We look right up here at the front balance. Just actually, it's just a little buffing compound down there. I thought it was chip paint, but it's not. So we look across the hood. The hood is in excellent shape. I don't really see any chips or scratches anywhere on the hood. Um, as we look at the windshield, there's no big, big chips or anything like that, but it just looks like it's kind of been gravel blasted a little bit. It's just got a bunch of little nicks in that windshield. Uh, antenna's in great shape. As we look at the front fender on the passenger side, the paint is gorgeous on it. There again, it's been wet sand and buffed beautifully. No blisters, no scratches. We come over here to the door. Um, door looks great as well. There's no blisters down low, um, front or back of the door. Lower quarter's nice, no blisters. Over the wheel well is nice. back here as well there's absolutely no blisters that I can see anywhere down low in this car and this paints older I mean um, I actually owned this car a few years ago and sold it to a gentleman out in uh, South Dakota he had it for a few years um, traded it back in and uh, so I know the paints at least five years old um, and maybe older um, we got it in we buffed it out again and it looks sharp it's got nice dual exhaust it's about 32 degrees this morning so we just got a little steam um, chrome is excellent around the back. We've had new chrome around the tail lights, new chrome all along the trunk lid, and the uh, quarter extension has got the new chrome on it, and the back bumper is excellent as well. It's got a nice Mustang cap. Inside the trunk, it's got the, the correct mat. Also has a uh, spare and everything in there as well, so trunk compartment looks nice. As we come around here, the vinyl top chrome looks to be in great shape here. Um, the chrome around the back window all looks good. It's got a set of Infinity rear speakers in it, which got a nice sound system. Black vinyl top is in excellent shape over here on the passenger side. There's no blisters anywhere that I can see over here. The top is nice. Go ahead and check our gap out. 
Our door gap looks great over here on the passenger side door in the back. The body lines line up nicely. Chrome shines nice in the door handles. As we come down here, the original door has never been body filler down in the corner. It's all original. There's a few signs, a few little spots. Like down in here, the car looks like it used to be a gold car. You can just see a few little chips in the door jam paint on it here and there. This rubber really is in decent shape, but we do have a crack right here in this rubber. Other than that, door jams look decent. Paint on the door jams ain't as nice as the paint on the exterior, but it's all covered really well, except for a couple of those chips that show the gold. Um, still plates are new. Seats look to be in good shape. We do have a, a small seat imperfection right up here by that front cord. Carpet's faded just a little bit. Headliner is in great shape. It looks like it's had a new headliner in it. It doesn't sag at all. I don't see any um, wrinkles or any holes anywhere. Visors are nice and hold up there tight. Uh, it does have seat belts in the back for two. Um, back door panels are the hardened plastic and they look to be in excellent condition. Also, our light does work on the park indicator and stuff. That uh, light on the shifter works. This is just a great turnkey Mustang, guys. Beautiful look, great sound, nice chrome dual exhaust tips coming out the back. We look up and down the sides on it. It just looks beautiful. The paint's very deep. We do have a, a very, very slight paint crack. You can see right by my finger here, right in, just in the paint. Just a very slight crack there. It's all solid down there, no blisters. Wheel well looks great. In front of the rear wheel, no blisters. Lower doors, no blisters. Lower fenders, excellent. A lot of these Mustangs, especially in a five year old paint or older, have some blisters here and there. But this is just a super solid car. I really like the look of these 17s on there too. It's just it's vinyl top trim. Looks like that's been replaced at one point. It looks great. Again, there's no bubbles anywhere here in this vinyl top. Roof looks great. gap lines up really nice um, we do have lines up good here we do have a little like a, probably like a little chip right here and maybe a little bit of a buff through just a little bit right here on this very corner there again we got a couple little spots here where you can see the, the original looks like maybe original gold paint in the door jams um, when I get it back to the shop I'm gonna have the detail guy touch that up a little bit Here's our code, 65A, 27, 16B. The other ones are kind of tough to read. Maybe 721, 188, and then axle and trans is 2 and W. Bottom corner of the door is great. Bottom looks good. Driver's side seat looks to be in really good shape. I don't see any rips or tears there. Uh, door panels on both sides are in good shape there as well. Window goes up fine. Our factory oil pressure and temp gauge are not hooked up up there. They got uh, they got them down here, which our oil pressure is sitting here idling, guys, for about probably 10 minutes. It's still running 60 pounds oil pressure, so we definitely have a good strong engine here. 
Um, our temperature is running cool as well. We're running about 155 for the temperature. Heater works great on the car. Wipers work and park. Um, the horn is not working. Gas gauge works. Alternator gauge works. It's got a really nice sound system in it. Works great. CD player. Rear view mirror is nice and tight. Going down the road, doesn't uh, bounce around. Visors are up there nice and tight too. Like I said, the headliner's in great shape. Um, paint looks great on the car. Just a really nice driving Mustang. It's really nice down the road. It does have air shocks on the back, so a guy can uh, adjust them a little bit if you want that a little higher or lower. Doesn't seem to be bottoming out anywhere here on this road. The heater works great. The fan motor works good in it. It's throwing plenty of heat. Like I said, we have about a 32 to 35 degree day right now. Um, car also has headers and a great sounding dual exhaust. I mean this car uh, really sounds mean Brake stop nice and straight on it No problem smoking the tires right up to 55.60, goes nice down the road. Yeah, this thing's got a great takeoff. Here's our brakes, guys. No pull left or right. Nice even pedal. Transmission shift's good. Here's our brakes again. Really nice driving Mustang, great interior. Um, this car is ready to jump in and drive home.